If you try to group things in a pivot table, occasionally you'll get this message, cannot group that selection. Here's why that happens and how you can fix it. This is Deborah Dalgleish from Contextures.com. In this pivot table, I've got dates, and instead of showing each date individually, I'd like to show them grouped by year and month. But if I right click and group, that message appears. Usually this problem, especially for numbers or date fields, is caused by problems in the source data. So I'm gonna go take a look. This is based on food sales data, and here's the date field. If I look at some of the dates, I can see in the formula bar that they show as a short date, but these two look suspicious. They're left aligned, which usually means it's not a real number or date. And if I click on one, I can see that it was copied and pasted from somewhere and it's just 8-Jan instead of a, a short date. Now I can fix these easily, it's just a sequence of dates, so I'll select the real date and drag down. Now you might have to look harder in your data to find the problem, but once you've got all numbers here, real dates, then that should fix the pivot table grouping problem. So I'll go back to that pivot table and now I'll refresh the pivot table. Now I'll right click and group and it gives me the grouping box so I can group by years and months without any problem. And here's another pivot table from the same data and I'd like to group the categories into bars and cookies or crackers and snacks. But when I select two categories, right click and group, I get that same message that it cannot group that selection. We shouldn't have a problem grouping text, but this pivot table, when I created it, there is a checkbox for add data to data model. So if I go to my sales data, insert pivot table, we get this checkbox. And if you check that box, you won't be able to do any grouping in the pivot table. So there are some benefits to having things in the data model, but there's also that grouping limitation. This pivot table I created without checking the box, and now I can group in this pivot table without any problems. So just something to keep in mind when you're creating a pivot table.